are at the Calabasas Farmer's Market and we are searching for some flowers to do some lonely bouquets on the spot. So I got some pretty sweet William and a nice deep red and a bright magenta. And then we have some ranunculus stuck in there, but that'll be a surprise for later. So. And since there aren't many uh, big focus flowers growing in my sister's garden at the moment, uh, I just brought a bunch of greenery with me. I brought some uh, asparagus ferns, and what else did we bring? Some rosemary with the pretty blue flowers growing on it, um, scented geranium leaves, and a few other little goodies, the berry branches and everything. And, and so we'll mix that with these uh, nice flowers that we got at the market, and we're gonna make some lonely bouquets on the spot. So let's get to it. Well, first let's tour around the farmer's market a little bit. Pretty. berries and try to sample of a sausage, chicken apple sausage. Yum. Well, let's go see what other goodies are in the genuinely good produce that is grown really locally and very reasonably priced. So if you're in the Calabasas area, I would definitely recommend checking it out. Looks tasty. Let's see what we come home with. Mm. Jalapeno hummus and feta. Yum. This is what I wish our farmer's market was like in Obelt, where we live in Belgium. Uh, I don't understand how such a, a farm-based agricultural region uh, doesn't have that local produce where you, you really get like the individual small farms coming and selling their produce at the farmer's market. So maybe it's something to aspire to.